Hello. I'm doing a hands talking video today. So I hope that's okay. But anyway, welcome to my channel. I'm Julianne. And I thought I would film me playing with my new pens. So we've got the mini, it's the ones that was in my haul. Um, we've got the mini, 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 mini paper mate. I don't know why I say that so many times. We've got the mini paper mate. Then I've got three preppies and I've got extra fine, fine and medium. Then I've got these little swan pens, which I can't remember who made them, but I'll put a link in the description box anyway. But I've got five. I think for ten pound, so two quid each, <laughs> and then this one for ten pound. This is the Jin Hao one five nine with the bent nib. Now I wanted to put converters in them all, but it turns out my converters won't fit, so I'll have to use what is supplied. And I think you need a special converter for the preppies, which I didn't realise. So these four is ink cartridges that are supplied. These little beauties come with a converter, which I'm really chuffed about. So does the Jin Hao. So let's see what we can see. So this is gonna be a bit on the boring side because I'm just gonna pop in cartridges. and then try to get them working. So I'm going to choose that one and that one. The Lottie and Thea. So this is, which one do I want? I want black first. So let's open Lottie. Ooh, that worked. That was good. That was a quick fill really, it's just once I got the thingy right. And I'm doing it again, I'm sorry. I should be talking to the camera. Because I know the I know this sounds rubbish. And so I'm sorry about that. Right, that's that one. With Lottie. I want Lottie in here. That'll do. Number That's done. So I want that one with the grey ink. This is sketch ink, by the way. Thea and Lottie. Can you see the colour underneath? It's brown. It's meant to be grey. Where's the thing? Let's try the paper mate first. I'm not using anything fancy, it's just a sketchbook. This is just a C white of Brighton sketchbook. It's a smooth paper. Ooh, it is a fine nib, this one. That's actually nice. Scratchy, but not in a nasty way. Ooh, like that. Let's skip in there. Oh, you get various marks as well. You can actually get it a bit thicker if you. Oh, it's a bit flexy. Oh, look at that. Oh, wow. If you don't. Let's see where it's upside down. Wow, look at that upside down. That's really good. Wow, that 
Ja. Now, it doesn't really have a name, it just says Mini Compact, so that's what it's going to be. And it's a fine nib. Right, now the preppies. Because apparently these are meant to be nice. This is the extra fine. It's a bouncy nib. Scratchy nib. Hmm. Okay, I'm rubbish my handwriting is with that. Oh, it digs in the paper and it skips. Wow. Scribbles texture. Bit scratchy, but it could because the nib is extra fine. I don't think it deserves the height. It's flex, it's a bouncy nib, but I don't think it actually it doesn't make any thicker marks. Try the fine. That's a bit smoother. It's not as scratchy and it doesn't seem to skip as much. So it feels a bit smoother. Now, medium. There we go. There we go. Ooh, that's that's actually quite smooth, but I don't know if it's too smooth. Oh, it seems to like trees at the minute. Craggy mountains. There's a scratch to the side, so it's not all smooth. Can't decide on that one. And then the swan. Now I'm just going to write swan pen. I don't mind that either. Scratch here. Sketching Lottie. Now let's do a little line. There's a bit skipping there. Oh, look at that. I like this one. I like this one for line making. You can just put different weights. A thicker weight. The thinner weight. That's nice. Whee! Scratchy. Digs into the thing. The there, I like. So that is a nice, going to be nice for drawing. For mark making. That's going to be nice for my art making. This one is the grey ink, which looked brown. I will put in the description box what these pens actually are. This one's not come through very well. It's the ink. You know, my little doggies. That's skipping. Now, is that? The ink problem or a pen problem? Oh, it's just not come through. I don't know. It feels. It's, it seems to be through. And if I press down, it's there. Look. Look at that. 
I'll have to find a different pen for this ink. This is the third of these pens I've used now, and that's the first time I've had that problem. And that's only with that sketch ink. See ya. It definitely makes it when you press down more. Because the thin lines are not very good, like it was with that. But ink needs a bit of encouragement. What a shame, I'll have to buy another pen. The Jinghao Bent Nib. 159 Bent Nib. Can you write? Ooh! Oh, I like already. 159. Oh, I like. Oh, look at the good, look at the goodies. Look at that, look at the marks it makes. The tree's got bigger because, oh, that's, that's inky wonderfulness. Look, look at the marks. If you just move it about as well when you're drawing, you get all sorts of random marks. Really like that nymph and it flows really nicely. And if I want really fine lines, I just turn it over. Impressed. Impressed with that chin how. I like that. So there we go. There's my inky goodness. And the winner was definitely the gin how. Preppies, last. See your ink, last. I like this, I like Lottie ink. That's a Lottie ink, that's a Lottie ink. I like that. There needs working on, needs checking up on. So there we go. There's me playing with the pens. So I hope you enjoyed. And I will see you on the next upload. Oh, by the way, please like and subscribe. Please, thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.